are discussing about SaaS testing adapting to new challenges and uh, opportunities for achieving quality assurance excellence from my experience. We are going to discuss about what is SaaS testing, challenges in SaaS testing and how to overcome that hurdles and how to achieve quality excellence and lastly few successful SaaS testing tips. Let us start with the quote. Be a yardstick of quality. Some people aren't used to an environment where excellence is expected. It is given by uh, the great Steve Jobs. Next, we are going to see about what is SaaS. Software as a service allows users to connect to and use cloud-based apps over the internet. In daily life, we are uh, not able to work or interact without any SaaS app, right? A cloud service provider that offers SaaS provides a whole software solution that you can pay for as you use it. You rent the use of an app for your organization and your users connect to it over the internet, usually with the web browser. All of the underlying infrastructure, middleware, app software and app data are located in the service provider's data center. The service provider manages the hardware and software and will ensure the app's availability and security of the app and your data with the appropriate service agreement. SaaS allows your organization to get quickly up and running with an app at a minimal upfront cost. Next, we are going to see about a key statistics. The SaaS market is projected to grow at a compound annual growth rate uh, from 11.7 percentage between 2020 and 2026 reaching a valuation of 307 billion dollars you may wonder what is SaaS testing the practice of SaaS testing involves accessing the functionality of online hosted software solutions SaaS testing's main mission is to make sure software solutions can fulfill the goals and the full potential why should we do uh, SaaS testing. SaaS applications are used by many customers at the same time. So it is vital to ensure the quality of the application before launch and ongoing releases. A good QA is inquisitive and thinks outside the box. Brings a fresh perspective and interacts with the app's features the way a new user would. We are going to see about the benefits of having a strong QA process. To ensure quality, prevent problems and make users happy and protect your reputation. Okay. Unless your product is tested, no one can guarantee that the app will work properly. QA can detect a problem before someone thinks of it. So they will prevent problems. QA contributes the user's first impression of the app and will make happy customers. Protecting the brand reputation is vital for the business. A flawless app is required to achieve this. When the application is tested in early stage, is uh, cheaper than making the changes to the entire system in the maintenance phase. What is unique in SaaS testing compared to other product testing? SaaS testing is different from traditional web application testing. We need to consider the additional criteria specific to the cloud environment along with our regular web application testing. Next, we are going to see about uh, challenges in SaaS testing. Each SaaS application should be functional in various environments and platforms without any issue since the users will not be in the same location as the on-premises applications. With users accessing the SaaS tool from diverse devices and browsers, it is necessary to test across multiple platforms and hardware. We need to test the application in mostly used environments to make sure the user experience is better for the customers. SaaS applications constantly release new features or bug fixes. Releases happen frequently. Therefore, there is less time to test the application. We need to test all the licensing factors, usage, the number of users, integrations, and functionality of the application for each release cycle. It is hard to handle privacy and security while multiple users access the same page simultaneously. The data security challenges faced by SaaS vendors are varied from each uh, for the each SaaS product. The SaaS companies are now being forced to ha change ha handling personal data that need to comply with privacy regulations. Following standard security procedures and adhering to those practices while working in parallel with the product's new features is really challenging. Over monitoring and logging for the 
as also a challenge. Digital accessibility is critically important for every organization as a key component of your organization's diversity, equity, and inclusion programs. And as a part of your commitment to inclusivity in your products, partnerships, and supports for your customers. For soft product companies, digital accessibility is now much more than a compliance checkbox. It is fast become, becoming a must-have and a clear differentiator for every company that wants to do business with large global corporations and public sector customers. The most attractive feature of SaaS applications is regular upgrades to the software. The clients cherish the benefits of the upgraded software without any hassle from their side. The upgrades will be done by the SaaS providers, but handling that is not a breeze. Um, to take, uh, take care of the multiple hardware and software, as well as the scheduling upgrades and maintenance at a time suits for the clients available in multiple geographical locations is in the world is very difficult. Next, we are going to see about how to overcome the challenges in SaaS testing. We have to conduct compatibility testing uh, with the tools uh, with the help of tools. And uh, we can test the sh short release cycles to we have less time only, right? So for that, we can automate the regression and integration test. Have a checklist and plan for the upgrades and maintenance. And don't forget to allocate time for exploratory testing. Set up a disaster recovery plan to ensure the app's availability for the application when the system is not available. You can implementing the right tools at the right time is vital to overcome the challenges in SaaS testing. For API testing, we can leverage the tool Postman. But for performance testing, we can leverage the tool JMeter. Security testing standards, OWASP. To test the accessibility testing, we have, we have to follow the accessibility testing guidelines and uh, the tools like WAN and IWN, uh, like that. For test management, you can leverage the test management tools like QAtouch. Compatibility testing tools like uh, browser stack and Lambda test to cover the compatibility testing part. Well, you may wonder what is quality excellence. So quality excellence refers to an internal drive to become the best. Therefore, it is drive to become a leader in quality. To achieve quality excellence, we need to consider few key points. So not only limited to these, um, the higher level points I have shared. A strategic uh, great team is important to have the execution correct. So a carefully selected team of uh, people can pinpoint areas of weaknesses and strengths of a company and create a day-to-day -day quality management testing plan. It is important to point out here that members of this team should be uh, from top management to the entry-level person. It is only by doing this that one can create a holistic approach and discover the best customized solution. And quality cannot be achieved unless the very concept is defined. Every one of your team should be made aware of that organization. What are all the organization's core values are? Clearly defined goals and acceptable standards have to be disseminated and maintained at all times. That said, this does not mean individual effort and creativity are hindered. Not like that. Rather, an open environment that offers an even playing field and transparency is what makes the difference in the team. So the team will have the right expectations and they will do the right work. We have to, um, uh, the mistakes are common, but what we have to do is we have to identify our mistakes and learn from them and how can we improve it. For that, uh, to may, uh, make the qualities excellence plan to be successful, in-depth study of organization past is a must. The team must spend analyzing and discussing what methods have been used before, how successful these initiatives have been, and what factors have contributed to that failures. Narrowing down the field in this way will help determine the correct methodology to use, be it personal accountability or proactive group training. Tools such as uh, online surveys and the employee feedback will help the help to improve that process. And the most important thing is culture, building a culture that embraces quality at every stage from uh, the starting from the requirements collection, intake, discovery, execution, and release. Enabling and driving continuous improvement and adoption of quality practices. Giving teams the ability to lead with a sense of purpose, openness, and trust. So 
the team will have the responsibility will take the responsibility and uh, the accountability they will take the accountability team collaboration is essential to address um, the gaps and deliver a high quality product and we have to recognize the team's uh, team members contributions and celebrate small wins with the team the last one is uh, like uh, qa is the first customer of the product it is important to empathize with the customers needs so we need to learn how to empathetic how to be empathetic we can also say that in three simple words understand feel and act the first principle of empathy is to understand the issue to do this we need to learn how to listen to understand and not to reply the second principle of empathy is to try and intentionally feel the emotions of another it is one thing to understand an issue but we need to develop an emotional connection to display empathy the third principle of empathy is acting based on the customer's feedback we have to uh, we have to understand and then we have to act uh, based on the feedback how can we improve the product at the end result our product will be uh, will have superior quality when the product has higher customer satisfaction customer retention also will increase a happy customer can be sure that will keep coming back also he he or she will refer your business to other people also next we a few vital qualities that we feel every tester should go upon for doing saas testing nevertheless it is not limited to just five the saas application is deployed in the cloud and it is necessary to make sure the system is up and running for 24 bar 7 and available to access by the customers without any downtime to monitor this we can leverage the tools application monitoring tools like new relic uptime robot and ping them these tools will notify us of any glitches in accessing the application periodically based on the configuration of alerts it is vital to log all access attempts into the saas system both failed and successful in any application testing business workflows is critical and important business workflows are the scenarios that every user will use often and without that they are not able to perform their tasks at all we need to collect the business workflows and prepare test cases for those in every release we need to execute these test cases and confirm that the scenarios are working flawlessly performance is the most critical part of saas applications every model should be performance tested along with the business workflows the application should be scalable when the application usage is heavy we need to build a strategy to do this and capacity planning after that we have to do performance testing periodically this will ensure the application's response time is better in heavy usage and not impacted by newly released uh, features and releases security testing needs to be carried out to find out any threats and data privacy from intruders and we have to have the data encryption in place uh, for the saas product and to uh, on top of that effective um, iim tools in shortly it is called as iim inter identity and access management controls that tools will help to um, leverage the single sign on authentication it will help uh, to uh, have multiple username passwords for to access the many systems in the setup instead of that with the single sign on you will be able to leverage with the single authentication you will be able to access multiple systems we are going to end with the most important point of, of never stopping to learn henry ford quotes about learning as anyone who stops learning is old whether at 20 or 80 anyone who keeps learning stays young the greatest thing in life is to keep uh, your mind young learning new things is a growth mindset as a queer person you have to have a growth mindset learning is a continuous process and never stop learning Thank you for your time.